lovely world. So this is going to be a very passionate vlog for you guys today. This might even be the best damn vlog I've ever posted on my channel. Now, I'm not I'm not going to, you know, ra ramble on and on about this, but from now on, I've read your comments. I've seen what you think of me. I know deep deep down y'all want to help me and it took me it took me a while to to fully accept that I know you guys just want to help me be the best damn version of myself that I can possibly be what that means is that there's no more video games there's no more movie watching there's no more TV watching there's not, I mean, I'm not going to say I'm going to give up all those things completely, but for right now, I've heard you call me fat. I've heard you call me ugly. I've heard you call me a lot of different things over the course of my lifetime. And sure, I didn't want to hear it. I didn't want to listen to it. I didn't want to see that. But the fact of the matter is, is that you guys wanted to help me be the best damn version of myself. You've lit a fire inside me that can never be extinguished. You've you've set up something I don't think you're ready for. I don't think anyone's ready for it. You want me to go out on these walks. You want me to do exercises. You want me to go and do you know, get a job and all that stuff. And, and maybe I will. Because I'm not saying it's going to happen today. I'm not going to say it's going to happen tomorrow. But sometime between now and let's say summertime, I'm giving myself a window. A window to figure out what's next. Do I learn a new language? Do I learn a new skill? Do I, you know, become the winner you all want me to be? Maybe. Or, or am I already a winner inside my heart? Am I already a champion? Because that, that right there is what you guys want to see. You want to see that fire. You want to see that termination. You want to see me look the best damn version of myself you've ever seen on this planet, on in this world. I'm not going to say it's going to come easy because nothing, nothing in this world comes easy. No matter how, di how lazy you think I am, how much of a loser you think I am, you may have just opened Pandora's box and realized that this this version of myself, this, this, whatever you want to call it, is who I am and what I represent. Because there is no one, not a single soul on this planet, that does not want to see me succeed. You all want to see me succeed. You all want to see me be the best damn person ever on this planet and I can't wait to show you this this journey this transformation that you're all about to witness and I'm not just preaching I'm not just telling you how it is this is and will always be what you started accept the fate that you started something that may just be what you want. You want me to earn money so I can have my own place? You just open that door. You want me to get my license? You may have just opened that door. You want to see me like super skinny? or have a six pack, you may have just opened that door. That door, and that door will never close. It never, ever will close. 
I am going to continue to do this YouTube thing for as long as I want. But I also realized something else. It took me a while, but I know all of my friends, all of my family want to see me be the, be the very best. Whether it's, you know, it's, it's, it's about reading. It's about learning that new language. It's about putting those movies away. It's about putting those TV, sh most of those TV shows away. It's about setting myself up for success over failure. But failure is also part of life. Every single person on this planet has failed at least once or twice, or let's say five, ten times in their life. But I have succeeded in so many other areas that you have no idea that I've succeeded at. I graduated high school. I, I did have one job before. Even though it was a long time ago, I did have a job. I've tried so many times to get my to to get my permit and sometimes I've succeeded and other times I failed you know and I didn't have that passion I didn't have that willpower that I have now I didn't have what I thought it could take but I've read I've read so many negative things about me I've read so many you know constructive criticism about me and I know that each and every single one of you who has ever been part of this channel or who's ever been part of my life at some point wants to see me be the very best. Whether it's, you know, learning a new language, whether it's learning to play chess, whether it's learning to, you know, be the best employee I could ever possibly be. Whether it's, you know, driving thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of miles, not hundreds of thousands of miles, but a lot of miles, wanting to see me go to all these events that I talked about time and time again, One, going to, driving to these places that I've always wanted to go to, like New York, Florida, you know, down to, down to down to Southern California, you know, up to Ohio, you know, down to Texas, all these places. It's going to take time. I know I'm not getting any younger. I know I'm this 31-year-old man living with his parents. And I know you want to see me not live with my parents anymore because you've, you've stressed that time and time again. And... Let's be honest, I'm getting a little sick of living within myself. I'm a little bit sick of, you know, not having a job myself. Now, I know I say all these things and I don't, don't, you know, follow through on them. But the fact of the matter is, is that maybe it's, maybe you're right. Maybe this time that I step up to the plate and hit a home run or... Or run down the field and catch a touchdown. Or run up and down the court and play defense and, you know, make baskets. Or run, you know, up and down the, ho the hockey rink and score a goal. And the right goal, by the way. And in the right basket. And in the right end zone. Or, you know, things of that nature. Maybe it's time that I step outside my comfort zone a little bit. And step outside this room and, you know, do things the way I want to do. I, I think you guys want me to do them. I'm not going to get rid of these posters or any of this stuff that's sitting on my wall. Because this is, this is who I am. This is what I, this is what I am. I love my, I love the teams that I follow. Whether it's the San Francisco Giants, or the Golden State Warriors, San Francisco 49ers, you know. Watching, watch when I watch Game of Thrones, you know, all of this stuff. Now, it seems like I'm getting off topic here, but the fact of the matter is, is that, look, we, I'm going to start listening because all I've been doing is ignoring 
and I shouldn't do that anymore. It it's gotten to the point where it's it's bad. It's gotten like so bad that I don't even know I didn't even know who I was or who I am. The fact of the matter is, is that things need to change. Things need to be different. I don't know how they're gonna become become different, but at some point next year hopefully because this year is pretty much over. Hopefully sometime next year I take that next step. I take that step that you all want me to take. It's not going to happen right away. I mean, it could if I really pushed for it. And maybe I will push for it as hard as I can. But I can't really, you know, tell what's going to happen in 2021. It, things could get go from really bad, like they are right now, to really, really good for me. And for each and every single one of you who watch these vlogs every single day. But that's just me. I know you guys leave comments in the comment section saying, Hey, this guy is a loser and he shouldn't be on YouTube. Maybe you're right. Maybe I shouldn't be on YouTube. And maybe I shouldn't watch movies. And maybe I shouldn't do all these things. But I just took the time to put the PlayStation 3 away. I took the time to put all of the DVDs away. I took the time to get rid of every single movie that I have on I on not iTunes but on on Amazon. I I deleted all of those, you know, things from my wish list. You know it's the next step. It it's not gonna be, you know, a giant step or a, a humongous step. It's this tiny baby step that could lead into a bigger step and and even a bigger step and even a bigger step until, you know, I become, you know, the best at, you know, learning a new language or the best at playing chess or the best at, you know, being an employee and becoming, moving up in the ranks. Whatever that, you know, job is, it's going to be here. In 2021. I don't know at what point in 2021. But it's going to be there. Accept it. Realize. That what I say. Right now. Is not a lie. It is 100% the truth. Now. If there is anyone. Who has a birthday on this. 23rd, 24th day of December. Christmas Eve. I want to wish you all a happy birthday. And you guys know the drill. Keep real and ciao.